Dear Mama. Dear Mama, here I am four years later crying after your transition. I think I'm crying harder now than I cried at the actual service. I was so busy consoling everyone else because they were so distraught that they left you there in that coffin and walked away. Dear Mama, I'm in the bathroom recording this because my boyfriend loved me too much to see me cry so he don't even know I'm crying. <laughs> you talked to him on the phone once and he always talks about it. He'll never forget it because you ended the conversation with telling him you loved him just like you loved everybody that you talked to. Dear Mama, my dear Mama, the one who even though her legs ached caught the bus with me to take me to the movies so the mall even when dad didn't help at all you still did it and if you dated anyone they had to do it too dear mama it's four years after your transition I remember working nights and shell oil that morning I was so tired I just wanted to go to my apartment and go to sleep but I had to stay faithful to come in to check on you and I'm glad I did you always taught me to follow my first mind and I did I came to check on you when I came in the apartment I saw your eyes roll just a little bit but you left right after that. You waited for me. Dear Mama, I started this day off by opening my eyes, giving thanks to the universe for letting me wake up and understand what day it was. I had a missed call from the The queen who called me while you were passing, I guess, transitioning. She knew today was the remembrance day for me, so she called me before I even woke up. She came to the apartment. She took the rings off your fingers that I couldn't get off. I um, am forever in debt for her to that. There's nothing that she can do wrong to me ever that'll make me forget that she did that for me and my mama. Dear mama, a lot has changed since you've been gone from this weird earth. I'm still pretty. <laughs> I'm still fabulous. I'm still strong. I'm still wise. I know you're still proud of me. I'm still eager. I'm still patient but slightly impatient. Dear mama, I'm still in love with the same guy. Dear Mama. I haven't finished school. I didn't go back. I might. Because you were valedictorian. Even in college. 4.2 grade point average. I guess I should truck on and finish, huh? Never could get my grade point average close to yours. I'm okay with a 3-2. <laughs> Dear Mama, I miss you. Nobody better not say nothing bad about my mama. <laughs> Dear Mama, I'm pressing on. I'm moving forward. I'm staying strong. But I had something inside of me that needed to come out. And here it is. Dear Mama, I drove down our street today. And what a blessing it is for me to even say that we have a street together. It took you 10 years to move here from Cleveland to Houston, Texas. You stayed with me for two and a half weeks. Dear Mama, there is nothing like a mother's love. I don't know if ever I'll feel that one day. You always wanted me to have a child. I'm still trying to get that puppy. Dear Mama. I love you. 
I always will. Nothing's ever going to change. Thank you for being transparent through altar talks with me. Thank you for allowing me to be who I am. Dear Mama, thank you for birthing me. You had so many failed pregnancies, but you carried me. And through candle work of my grandmother, I got here. Dear Mama, you were awesome, you were strong, you were fabulous, you were nice, you were sweet, you were kind, you were patient, you were loving, you were enduring. Dear Mama, the only thing about this time is that it's so close to my birthday. I always remember you asking me, what do you want for your birthday? You always got it for me, got it to me, got it somehow. Hook a crook, remember? Dear Mama, I love you.